What's up, guys? So a lot of people have been asking me, how do I get into the bottom six? Well, it's pretty easy. All you gotta do is just, you know, make yourself pretty popular in social media, talking shit, posting memes, just being pretty active, posting videos, crap. It's all kind of about being like popularity. Not on how good you are, how strong you are. I know all these guys asking, like, oh, let me pull a beat all you guys. Like, well, yeah, you probably beat us all, but you're not even, like, cool. <laughs> not a fun dude. Why would we want you there? Um, anyway, though, so you got to be a, a resident of Illinois. It's Illinois bottom six, dude. But uh, I think... Uh, Next time, if we ever do it again, which we might, if it goes pretty well, we're gonna do. Um, uh, it's gonna be like if you if you're a part of a team that's also based in Illinois, then you're in, included in the selection of this little tournament. But uh, I'm gonna try to pick uh, pullers from different uh, different teams. You know, I try to try to make it so that they're pretty close, pretty close in strength. Like I'm not gonna like have like some amateur guy who talks a lot of crap pull against like uh, um, I don't know pop like Pablo D. You know like I, that ain't gonna fucking happen. He's just gonna wreck everyone. You know. Um. Anyway, so the guys I chose, I mean, obviously I chose me, but <laughs> um. But yeah, uh, Steve Poland. Um. He's in that. I mean, he's a good buddy of mine. He's all. Talking shit all the time, joking around. It's a lot of fun at tournaments. Like these guys I pick, like they're they're fun fucking guys. Like I love hanging out with these fellas. Um, Phil Delaney, he's a funny dude. He's he does uh, rage raps. He like makes some awards for Illinois, like Illinois State. He did those. Uh, the Illinois rankings. He helped or he made those uh, little uh, those plates. They're pretty cool looking, and um, yeah, I mean, he, he, they had a video of him as the uh, world's strongest man, Phil Delaney, lifting 27 pounds. Yeah, that shit was funny. So I mean, I, I had to put him in there. He, he was a good choice. And um, Steve Daniels, that little fuckhead. Yeah, he, he's in it. He, I mean, all the shit talking he does, and he's pretty well known. And his own team, Iron Man Dangerous, that talks all this crap. He runs away all the time too if you challenge him to a fight. <laughs> but yeah, he, he's a funny guy. I, I knew he, he talked a lot of shit going up to uh, the tournament, so I figured he'd be pretty good. And um, who else we got? Uh, oh, Tom Olson. Yeah, he, he talks shit too. Um, he always, always bragging that he can beat everyone and I mean, we're, we're going to see about that, see how he does. Uh, we also got uh, Joe Flores. I guess he's just officially now a part of No Borders with, with uh, Steve Poland. But um, he was actually a uh, second choice. We had uh, another guy, but uh, he had uh, to back out. But uh, we might, uh, might call him up for another bottom six tournament for, the, for later in the year. We'll see, though. We'll see. Uh, otherwise, yeah, Joe Flores. Picked him. Um, that dude... If you, ever, if you ever go to a tournament and you close your eyes, the one guy you're going to hear is Joe Flores. Because that guy fucking just yells all the time. <laughs> but in a good way. You know, he's always cheering you on. He's like, yeah, go, buddy. you are like, you know, cheers his team on. He's like, up in up in the face. He's he'd be pretty good at the tournament. Definitely, um, you know, make it worthwhile. Make it a lot more fun. But yeah, it's, that's the six guys. I think uh, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. There's gonna be a lot of shit talking. Um, I mean, we're all buddies, but you know, it's on the table. It's different. Always talking crap to each other. And I, I know there's gonna be some rivalries up there. I mean, I know Stephen Daniels probably has a rivalry with uh, everyone up on the table. He's always saying that he's gonna 
smash low. <laughs> but yeah, um, the belt was ordered last week. I'm actually just supposed to be sent to my house today. So I'm on my way home right now. Hopefully it's there in the box waiting for me. But I'll, I'll show some pictures of it later online if I get it. You know, I'll show some pictures of me wearing it too because, you know, I'm the one going home with it. So I don't even know why I got to bring it to the bar. <laughs> but yeah, uh, February 29th at uh, North Avenue Tap in Waukegan, Illinois. Weigh-ins are from 4 to 5. Following that will be the bottom six tournament. It's a round robin. Uh, after that, we're going to do the amateur. And then after amateurs, we got the king of the table for the men. Oh, no, we'll do queen of, queen of the table for the women. And then uh, king of the table for the men. Left and right, open. Pros, amateurs, anyone can do it. Um, and the winner uh, takes a big piece of the pot home with them and a little award from our boy uh, Phil Delaney. Also, we got a Steve Baldwin coming down to uh, to ref, and uh, I heard uh, James Dean is going to come down to help him too. I heard, but uh, also I'll be around MCing for the night, <sighs> and uh, also helping out with the ref and helping out wherever I can. And uh, I'd like to thank Steve Poland for uh, hooking up the bar. He's my partner. He's my boy. <laughs> All right, guys. See y'all later.